right there. It was like the old albacore days. Here you go, here you go. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Boom! You got one. Oh! oh. oh. Ah. Ah. Oh yeah! 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 Fighter! Oh. oh! That's a big one. That's a monster. This was a really fun day and a half trip from back in September of 22. Yeah, it only took me six months to get this video out. It was a charter with a bunch of friends, so you'll hear me say some stuff that I wouldn't say normally to strangers. Uh, we really get along really well. The trip was great weather, uh, great crew as always. Brian and the team are awesome. Uh, on this trip, we started down the line, kind of below Ensenada. We got a real good go at the Dorado right away. Then we did a lot of looking, a lot of traveling, kind of hanging out on the boat until a spotter plane called us into a pretty eager school of yellowfin tuna. That's really where the bulk of this video comes in, having fun with those yellowfin. And then after that, we looked around some more and then finished off with a sunset stop for some more Dorado. What a great day and a half trip. This was a lot of fun, a lot of fun to be on. Here we are getting ready. Anticipation's high. Stories from last year's trips are flowing. Good times. Here's some of the stuff for my tackle box. You never know what you're gonna run into, so you kinda just bring a little of everything. Our first stop of the day, I'm not surprised there weren't more people at the tank getting ready. I like it when it's not crowded. Once everybody figures out the fish are biting, they're going to get out of their bunks and get fishing real quick here. Really nice to hook up with the Dorado right away. This is great. Come over here. The first fish of the day is always nerve wracking because as far as you know, it could be the only fish you're going to catch all day. You get a few on the boat and it's it doesn't really matter as much. You're just there to have fun at that point. I like how this Dorado laid out real nice. That's not normal. Thank you. I got it. Get him, Hugh, get him! It's pandemonium! Oh, that's a nice Dorado. I like this walk feels choreographed. Watch, look, there goes the Dorado getting out of the way, getting around the corner. Someone grabs my fish. I dig that. Follow him, guys, please. Nice one. There's another new one, Dorado. Yeah, buddy. I'm coming in. Oh, the follower right there. Eat it, eat it. Oh, he ate it right there. That's a nice one. Yeah. yeah Did you see? He followed it all the way to the boat and ate it right there. Yeah, that's cool. All the way down. <laughs> you ready here? Oh. Ready with the gal? It's so cool. We're ready on the bow. Yep. Oh, Louis, oh, you got a big one, Lou. Don't say that. Oh. Right, next one's ready. Thank you, happy to have that one on the boat. The one, two there. There, making best use of your time. 
Um, so, Terry, there's a funny story with this one. I wound it up all the way to the boat, bringing yeah. it to change my bait. And he boom. followed it. Right there, he ate it. <laughs> Ready? Yeah, buddy. Thanks, bro. Can I get a picture on your phone, actually? Sure. Oh wow, that's someone's fish. Work around the corner, guys. Is that your fish, man? Man, I can't emphasize enough how important it is you're able to cast on a sport boat. You got to get that bait away from the boat. If you're not a good caster, practice in your backyard. That's all I can say. Oh, there's a bite. Yeah. Look at the boils over here. Oh, that's my fish! <laughs> I love that. Love it! I just hooked it. I'm surprised he's coming in, but we'll see what happens. trying he's still a little hot i'm trying <laughs> this shows that gaffing's a two-man job look the fisherman needs to uh, be able to pull the fish into position i like to say lay it out it's fucking hot man and then the he gaffer only... gets a nice easy shot at the I mean, fish he's not running so we're just oh this fish it helps lucky. when the fish wants They're to cooperate too your way. that one did not that worked I took a quick break from fishing to take a picture of Dave's fish here. And a nice one it is. There you go. I wasn't mad. <laughs> That's a pretty fish, huh? Yeah. I already broke off too. You did? Right at the beginning, on top, just pink. It's, I haven't set this drag on the floor, I never used it before. This guy'll help you. I've got four on the boat now. Oh yeah. I would take video. Yeah, yeah. Why don't you go ahead and delete that section out? <laughs> <laughs> I let two of them go, Terry. I hate the Mexican limit, man. Gerardo don't make you look like good gaffers, do they? <laughs> that was that was that was a that was a hero gaff in the air right there though. <laughs> Pick that one out of the air in the head. Lay them out flat, Rick, like a like a halibut. <laughs> Woo! Rick! Rick! Yeah. 22, 7. We did pretty good. Yeah. I'll say it over and over. It really helps to keep on the lookout when you're looking for fish. These guys are pros and they looked all day long. Check out how I skipped right over the healthy food and went right to the sweet stuff. I think everybody did that on the boat. You ready, Nate? Oh, yeah. You doing it? You doing it? Get him, Hugh! Pretty colors. 
Look at Hugh's shirt. Matches the Dorado here. I think that's funny. Fish bin. Ooh. One hand on my freaking rod and I grab Nate's shoulder. It just fucking grabbed and he leaned forward and held me up and I get going. <laughs> After the Dorado, it was a pretty long run. We had some food, we had lunch, we hung out. Then we looked for a while and looked and looked and looked. And then there was an airplane out in front of us and Brian said, hey, the airplane found a school. They're circling it right now on them. But it was really neat to see this, to have a, a spotter plane just call us into the fish. We didn't know it yet, but it's going to get ugly. Fishing is going to be out of control. This is going to be a fucking cluster. It's almost like you can tell it's going to be a cluster on the stern. But it's like that, I kind of go up the rail a little ways to get away from everybody. I don't want to be right in the thick of everything. They're right underneath the boat, free swimmer. Everybody's got to fish on. This fish takes a little turn to get away from the crowd. As soon as it makes that turn, I just try to go as fast as I can and get away from everybody. I'm about everybody. ready. Can't see him. You want me? I'll bounce him. I got him. I got him. <laughs> when the fishing's this good, I go straight to the jig and the heavy line. No messing around, one after another. Oh, they are on the shoe, aren't they? Also, look, I'm way up the side of the boat, getting away from the crowd. Dude, you could look at. Forget that They're madness. Like everywhere. Oh, right there. Oh my God, you can see them all swimming around. It was like the old albacore days. There we go. Beautiful. Stapling the fish reminds me of when I used to work on the boats. It's fun for me. The jig slowed down, so I went back to bait. It's hard for me not to be hooked up when everybody else is getting them. Back to the madness so I can get a, a bite. Get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Boom. Fit. Well, I guess the bait worked. There it is. You can feel it. Tap, run. Oh, hello. I think I got him, too. I got his brother here for you. The family up there. I don't know if I'm over or under you. I'm going to go over. Man, there's some good teamwork here. Everybody's following their fish over or under just like it's supposed to be. I don't remember there being a lot of fish lost on this trip due to tangles or getting crossed up. That's actually pretty good for the day. I was gonna bounce them. That'll work. I'm gonna try the new fishing pole. What made this trip even better was that I won a reel in the raffle the night before. My buddy wanted this, won the rod, so we put it together so we could fish it for the day. Perfect. 
first cast with the raffle rod. That was nice. <laughs> it casts all right. <laughs> oh. I'll keep it. <laughs> that works. <laughs> you're, you're, you're under me. You're under me, Kev. I got you. Here, here. Mine's pretty close. Okay. Oh shit, I'm crossing somebody. Yeah, go under. Under, under, under. Nice, guys. Would you rather grab these hot little yellowfin or Crazy Dorado? Uh, bigger targets. Yeah. Way less, way more targets. To like actually get, see how he's sliding in between the hook? Yeah, you got a big gap. Yeah. This is only one. <laughs> Just lay him out right here and I'll get him. Alright, let me uh, one more circle. One. On the boat. Brock, I need a number. Hey, wind up, Jamie. Thank you. I don't plan on being out long. See, I'm bit. I'm ready for the stick. If you made it this far in the video, don't give up. The best fishing is still on the way. I'm gonna go to a dig. I think I want a sweater with the sleeves cut off. It's official, I'm making one. When the fishing's wide open, I like to try different things. I think on this sequence, I'm gonna try the popper, the surface iron, a stick bait, and even some plastic. Oh! On the land. <laughs> on the land. Oh. Yeah. Holy shit, what happened there? Well, the popper got bit. That was easy. Dude, that is uh, a little more fish than I've been fighting you earlier. You no, your drag's just too loose. Go this way. Oh, it came out. Let's go to the bow to throw this thing. I shouldn't have been throwing it on the stern anyway. It's too crowded back there. Come on, you little fucker. Could be all over. They're looking at it. We got one over here. You're gonna try and swoop in on your followers. I'm not seeing. I don't see something work. We got blowed up on twice, but they never took it. All right, switch into a different jig. This thing right here. Yeah, baby, a little stick bait. Look at this stick bait. There you go. Close. Look at them, they're chasing it. Oh! Oh, there's oh, one! <laughs> That's what I was looking It was a faster retrieve, totally. Yeah. Sometimes you just have to find what they want. They love this thing. My only issue is I'm only using 25. There we go. It's on the boat.
Can we go two for two with this thing? Let's see. Oh, they yeah. like this one. <laughs> so much fun. It's amazing the difference between the popper and the stick bait. They ate this thing. Dude, they're eating the stick bait every cast right away. So awesome. Does two casts in a row count as every cast? Yeah. Nice. Cool, huh? A plastic? Yeah. Well, I was like, that didn't bring any. I was like, oh. There's all the jigs. If you need any jigs, it's all you want there. The albacore used to love fish traps. So that's why I tried this. Man, I thought this thing was going to get chewed. Oh shit. How come I'm not bit yet? Watch out. Which way are you going? Oh, there it is. <laughs> you know the fishing's good when the crew gets to fish. This is our cook. Whole day we're all getting a bite and get skunk. Oh, because that's what you want to get. I'm trying to get 10 pound bass, and I have. Now I'm trying the surface I'm iron. I couldn't resist. Yeah. I love seeing the, the thing swing. That's how I feel, yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. I think I'm over you. I feel like everything I threw at him, they ate at the front. Oh! Oh. <laughs> That's what I wanted. No, I was winding it fast. I pretty much ate it right away. It was pretty much nothing. It's fun hanging out on the bow with the crew. I feel like one of the guys. <laughs> I got one on the jig. I hooked one on the jig. I haven't got one yet. <laughs> well, right. I'll take a stick. Look at it. All shoulders. That's how you know it came right in. I laid him out for you. <laughs> Look at that. I'm soaked on that right there, baby. That's what I wanted. <laughs> it's my favorite to catch fish on the jig. <sighs> the one I got on the popper it hit the water and it blew up on it. So it didn't even know what was there, you know? Like, it could have been anything that hit the water. Come on, Terry, lay them out better than that. That's your fault. There, you go. there see, Perfect. nice layout, nice layout. Mayhem on the little yellow fish. Oh, bubbles! I totally got that. Dude, how come you're not bad? I saw him eat it. There it is. There it is. Instant on the corner. Here you go, here you go. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, he's on. <laughs> Someone throw another one out. I got you, I got you. Everyone with a bait in the water is bendo right now. This is as good as it gets. Alright, I think I should toss one. This is so crazy. It's like one after another. Ready? Oh, on the, on the cold sniper. All right, Hugh, you narrate now. Robert working on a fish. Looking serious, very serious. He's 
you go under. Oh yeah. Oh, I can see your fish. Damn boy, all shoulders. That fish is hot. That's a nice one though. That's a thick Damn, nice stick. Yeah, baby. All right, let's see that smile, Robert. Yeah, yeah baby. Good job, Hugh. Come on, come on, when it's like this on the party boats, it's all about watching your line, making sure you're not crossed with other people. Man, it's so crazy when it's like this. It's cool when there's so many fish because you don't care if you lose one and you're nicer to everybody. All right, go for it. On the bumper. <laughs> Boom! You got one. Oh, hold it. Do you want to use my jig? Try this. Yeah. Throw yeah. that water. It's a 50 pound test. Just, just lower it down and hold on. Lower it and hold on. Huh? Yeah. Just, just don't even cast. Just lower and hold on. You don't need bait when it's like this. Ah, oh, free school. How come you don't have one yet? There you go. There you go. Oh, did you see that out of the water? You're right? I should not be throwing the jig on the stern. This is stupid. <laughs> I'm trying to keep it out of their mouth. Look at them, look at them, look at them. Look at so them. much fun. No, I was trying to, yeah, thank you. Here, here. Oh, thanks. Dude. They're trying to eat it, just hang in there. That was on my jig. They Did got it. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, I hope I got that. I did. Oh, these fish are hungry. Holy shit, those fish are hungry. Are those fish hungry? <laughs> Under the jig. This reminds me of shaking off barracuda. That's how I used to do it. Got it. Yeah. All right, you ready for this? Here goes my jig. You see it? Oh. oh. I didn't even cast. I mean, I didn't he even whine. Yeah, so, right you want this one? I'll trade you poles. Go. Follow it up, follow it up. This is why I like to have multiple poles ready. Watch me just grab one out of the rack. Stay. Back in the water right away. Oh shit! I think follow that was it, like it, two fish in like 15 seconds. Sorry, coming down. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Ah, follow your line. This one's foul hooked. Oh, almost didn't make it over the rail. Watch this, watch this, watch this, Phil, watch this. Watch this, you ready? Watch, watch, watch. Are you with me? Oh, watch this. Oh, shit. Unreal. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Seriously, look at them all in the water. Oh! We're saying uh-oh because the boat's about to move. And here comes the Pacifica. They're going to take this school over. These guys don't have a clue what's about to happen to them. This is going to be legit. Oh! Ah! Looks like they're bit. Oh my 
fucking around if you don't have a fish yet. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to. I totally think they're going to get into the fish. It's so cool when you can hand off a school. These guys are so stoked right now. I love it. That was insane, dude. Yeah, was. You got one on the jig. Well, you got one. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of fun. That, right, the jig or just everything? Yeah, everything, but that jig was cool too. Right, when they're biting like that, fishing the heavy gear, the jigs, yeah. it's like there's no messing around. You put it on the boat, you drop it back down in. No I getting bait. Here's the afterglow. It's almost like a hangover or something. After all the fish, everybody's kind of relaxed and everything. <laughs> I'd call this a good day. Everybody got a few fish. Those guys are all on that stool we were on. Awesome. We're not done yet. We're still looking around. Sunset stop, baby. Sunset stop. You know, I thought we had an idea to fish like morning. That one's the mail. Free school. Yeah, buddy. That's a fatty. That one's proper right there. That's a boy. How do you feel? That's right. Way to end it. Look at that sunset. What a way to end it off. Another Dorado stop. Dude, these guys work their butts off all day long, every day. Make sure to empty your wallets and tip them well on the way out. One last good meal before they put us to sleep and take us home. Secret safe, safe with just you.